Uh oh. Okay. Uh oh, froze up. Oh, okay. Here we go. Hey, <laughs> my lead almost had technical difficulties there. I might still have to. Okay, I think the technical difficulties are gone now. Hey, my Legion, how y'all doing today? And welcome to What Wednesdays. Today I'm here to review Clear American Peach uh, Sparkling Water or Flavored Water. Boy, yeah, Flavored Sparkling Water. And this is out of Walmart from Walmart, a uh, Walmart brand. Now, with the price on this, it's usually 59 cents, which is a heck of a good deal. Uh, Dollar General has something similar as they want 75 cents unless they raise the price, which is still isn't bad. And then Surefine has like that uh, sparkling love from Weight Watchers for like a dollar sixty now, which is really expensive. But I wanted to try those anyways. And uh, see if they ain't good. Zero sugar, no calories, no caffeine, so no sodium per serving. Got a picture of a peach right there, so let's try it out. Um, one thing about it is it has like it says twelve uh, three servings per container. Cause this is the new uh, way they do of the uh, the nutritional facts. They have like the servings per container, nutritional facts per container. I mean per serving and then per container. So it's ten for the whole container, which is still really good. It only has ten milligrams of sodium and two grams of carbs for the whole thing. Oh, and it has uh, potassium for the whole container. It has four hundred fifty. I mean four hundred forty milligrams, ten percent. That's pretty good. Let's try it out. I saw it 59 cents, you know. Bad. Hopefully it's good. I think I had some other stuff in there I, I like too. Definitely smell of peach. That's really good. I mean, it has that artificial peach flavor, uh, flavor to it, but I think it's good. Very refreshing. On a summer's day, Really good. Now, weather-wise, well, whenever you see this, it's supposed, the temperature is supposed to start plummeting again. Because we had a... pretty good weekend and stuff like that, um, weather-wise. Because last... Because we were having, like, really bad temperatures, you know. It was really in the 20s and stuff. And then it started to get a little bit higher... Friday and the third and fourth, and then Saturday, Sunday, uh, I was in the 40s, high 40s, and then like, you know, nighttime would be like the 30s, because it's nighttime and wintertime, so, you know, of course you have that. Oh, cool. And then uh, throughout the week, Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, it's going to start raining again, I mean, it's going to be a sloppy mess, but it's going to be in the mid to high 40s, in the, and in the third nighttime, and then, as you see this, this will be up. Well, this be up at probably 8 o'clock. Uh, according to what I look at, the temperature is supposed to start coming down for like 42 at 4 o'clock to like in the 30s. And then it's going to be in like the 20s for the rest of the weekend. So I don't know how the weekend's going to be. This weekend's going to be. It's probably might. I don't know. Hopefully it won't be too icy because it's going to be raining so much. But I hope you like this Wet Wednesdays, everybody. And I, I really enjoyed doing these videos for all of you. Um, the Wet Wednesdays and a weather update. So until next time, bye. Please take care of my legion.